Howdy guys, welcome back. So I'm reading this book that some of you may know. It's a book that uh, Lisa and Kevin Cotter wrote it's called The Dating Detox. And I'm doing it for Lint. Um, and one of the things that The Dating Detox asks of the readers, and, and don't be discouraged, but The Dating Detox um, asks the readers to take on a dating fast. Um, so what exactly is a dating fast? A dating fast looks different for many people. Sometimes it's from an extended period of time, such as years. Um, sometimes it's weeks. Um, sometimes it's months. Um, it just depends on what you're trying to do with the dating de uh, sorry, with the dating fast. And the purpose of the dating fast will be different for everybody. Um, of course it's too fast from dating, but the reason as to why you want to take this dating fast um, may be different. But in total, taking a dating fast um, allows you to really look at your life. The really cool thing about the dating fast is, is it allows you to look at someone in the way that they're meant to be looked at. Um, not as this person that can potentially give you a relationship or that a relationship can come from um, these people that you meet, but that you are able to truly actually see this person for who this person is without looking at them in the relation aspect. And it's actually a really cool thing because when you look at somebody um, in that aspect, you're able to love them in the way that they need to be loved. Not as an object, but as the person for who God made them to be. And in a dating fast, you can set um, certain parameters for you, um, or at least for me, I have to set parameters because if I don't have an achievable goal, then it's harder for me to know if I'm on track with that goal or if I'm getting off track with that goal. Um, so for example, some parameters for me are not texting the opposite gender after a certain time, not being alone with the opposite gender um, unless it's like in a group setting or it's in a public space. And um, I'm going to be really honest, in the case that I happen to look at the someone of the opposite gender in that way of seeing them as like, hey, this would be a really cool relationship. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing, but it shouldn't be the only thing that you think of when you see that person. And if I happen to fall into that stance, then I say um, a Hail Mary and I ask Mother Mary to pray for me. And it keeps me on track in seeing their true dignity and their the human side of them. Taking a dating fast um, also helps grow you as a person. Here's the whys of taking a dating fast. Um, one, you want to um, look at people the way that you should look in that. Look them, look them as. You want to prepare yourself if you're thinking of going into a vocation such as marriage um, or any potential relationship that you might have in the future. Um, it will help prepare your heart. Three, it helps you grow closer to God because your focus isn't only like relationship, 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 but it's also more on God um, because dating be a dating fast will allow you to focus your attention more on God and what God wants you to do with your life um, and saying yes and in the things that he wants you to say no to. And it gives you a clear vision for going about your life without having like those goggles on that cloud your judgment. Since you can't partake in those um, things, then it allows you to turn closer to God. So dating fast is basically to help you to look more at other people for who they are instead of what they can give. It helps you to focus on your relationship with God by putting God as your priority instead of a potential relationship. And um, it allows you to say more yes to God on the things that you normally wouldn't say yes to because of being fearful um, of what that might be, um, maybe not being available enough in case someone comes along. Um, but it allows you to fully say yes to God with your heart. And when you do it centered in Christ, it allows you to give more of yourself because you're not worried about what's going on around you because God should be your main concern. So that's the small basics of a dating fast. But yeah, a dating fast is what it sounds like. You're just fasting from something for a certain amount of a uh, period of time. And once that fast is over, it's supposed to change you as a person. Um, it's not gonna be like maybe this huge major change, but it's gonna be something that might make you look at the way you see things differently. In taking this dating fast, it has allowed me to truly see the beautiful personality that the people around me have. And in a way, also, like I said, like a greater amount of 
of space to say yes to God instead of being like, no, no. So that's a dating fast. Yeah. <laughs> I hope that helps. Um, I need to clarify just very simply what a dating fast is. Um, but yeah, so that, so, so this is the 411 on a dating fast, a small 411 on the dating fast. So I hope this video helped in some way. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys later. Have a great and beautiful day. Um, stay holy, my friends, and may the force be with you. See y'all later. Bye.